While the city of San Diego believes their water misreadings are an isolated incident to just four areas, however, folks in other parts of town have unusually high bills in the same time frame. And it went up to 470. Janet Jacobson still talks about her November 2017 water bill. This is what she calculated. Double her normal use, so she called the utility. They sent someone out who had a checklist of all the various things that help your home be more efficient, and we had all of them. No leaks found and nothing wrong except the high charge, but she paid it so her water wouldn't be shut off. I thought I was the only one. That is until the city admitted at least 343 meters in four areas were misread, with the average overcharge being $300. Well, it makes me wonder if it isn't more widespread. Every time you, one of these issues come up, it really questions people's faith in government. Councilman Chris Kate says so this is a basic ABI function of local government time. that needs correcting. My hope is that it hasn't gone outside the four areas, the four neighborhoods that they've identified. But again, that's why we're going to continue to be vigilant and making sure that people who are experiencing high bills, whether in my district or in other districts, get the answers that they deserve. And the reading on the meter was, she said, the same that it said on the bill. Back over at the Jacobsons, they know something is up. I feel like they felt they could reach in your pocket, take your money, and when you question why they did it, they don't know. And they pass the buck to person to person, department to department, and leave you with just, we'll turn your water off if you don't continue to pay. In Claremont, Travis Rice, 10 News.